A congested Crown Heights street continues to cause more than just traffic over in Crown Heights. Residents say the presence of buses, speeding and accidents have them petrified to even leave the house. News 12's Brittany Cadet is at St. John's Place where these incidents have been affecting community members. But this block, it's, it's a disaster. It's always something. I, I, I can't. I just can't. Residents expressing how dangerous St. John's Place has gotten in the recent years. They tell us crashes, an enormous amount of traffic, <laughs> and horrific accidents happen on this street constantly. We spoke to resident Robert LaPointe, who shares what he's had to witness due to failing traffic organization. It doesn't make any sense for two buses to be on this really skinny stretch, and it causes problems up and down. Those, ca those problems cause traffic to back up on Nostrand. People are frustrated with the traffic, as we all are. They drive really quickly in and out of traffic, um, trying to bob and weave to get past the buses. Buses get jammed. Just a few weeks ago, on the corner of St. John's Place and Nostrand Avenue, two children and an adult were hit on their way to school as a driver hopped the curb striking the adult. So we were, we're not we were not surprised by by this accident because there's terrible terrible street planning on this block. Not only are cars and accidents a main problem of this road, but so are buses trying to make their way down this narrow strip. I know I know it's easy when you're watching this to think you know, why do I care about two little blocks in Crown Heights? But if you're in Prospect Heights waiting for the B45 and you're like, where is it coming? Um, it's because they're stuck here. Residents also tell us they don't feel comfortable letting their kids go to the corner store with the fear of their kids potentially getting hurt by incoming traffic. We're also told that the neighbors will continue to advocate for a safer street to live on, driving laws enforced and getting buses rerouted. I don't want to move. In Crown Heights, Brittany Cadet, News 12. Wow. All right. So we reached out to the MTA and the Department of Transportation, and MTA says our borough bus network redesigns are meant to reimagine the borough's bus network and is driven by customer feedback. They say that the core of the redesign to improve evolving needs of local communities and considering factors such as population growth, commute times, and travel patterns to be considered. The forthcoming Brooklyn bus network redesign is expected to include a look at the B, uh, B45, like you heard, and B44 routes. And they say this is a good opportunity for those with concerns about the route to get them addressed. We have yet to hear back from the DOT.